Continuing to work with formulas, in this question we're asked to find the length and width of a rectangle given a rectangular swimming pool, given that the perimeter is 200 feet and the length is 40 more feet than the width. So let w equal the width and then w plus 40 equals the length. And we know the perimeter is 200 feet. So we'll go ahead and label our swimming pool here. We'll call this the width. This is also width. This is the width plus 40. And this is the width plus 40. So we know the perimeter equals 200 feet. And we also know that the perimeter of a rectangle is 2 times the length plus 2 times the width. And we know that that equals 200 feet. And remember the length is the width plus 40. We've got that both in our given information and labeled on our diagram. 2 times w plus 40 plus 2w equals 200. We'll go ahead and distribute the 2. So 2w plus 2 times 40 is 80 plus 2w equals 200. Combine like terms, 4 times the width plus 80 equals 200. Subtract 80 from both sides. 4 times the width equals 120. Divide both sides by 4, and we get that the width is 30 feet. So that means the length, that equals the width plus 40 which equals 30 plus 40, which equals 70 feet. So the length is 70 feet, and the width is 30 feet. To check, we can just make sure the perimeter is correct. So 2 times 70 plus 2 times 40 equals 140. Sorry, I put in 40 there when I should have been putting in 30. The width is 30 feet. So 2 times 70 plus 2 times 30, we want to know does that equal 200? And that's 140 plus 60. Does that equal 200? And yes, it checks 200 equals 200. So our solution is the length is 70 feet and the width is 30 feet. That's a really big pool.